It's November 22nd, 1963. Three shots are fired in Dallas, Texas, and news is out. JFK is dead. JFK's assassination was one of the most grieved days in U.S. history. Many people would do anything in their power to go back and change it. Jake Ebbing, a language arts teacher in Lipson Falls, Maine, and Al Templeton, Jake's friend, have unlocked the key to the past. Little do they know that there are many consequences with this new discovery. Jake Ebbing gets a call. It's from Al. He finds it suspicious, but answers it anyway, in the case it might be urgent. Little did he know that that call would turn his world upside down. My name is Rebecca, and I'm going to be talking to you about 112263 by Stephen King, the book that makes the characters go through many ups and downs as they are on a mission to change the past. Jake, the teacher who teaches a GED class for extra money for adults, receives an essay from one of his students, Harry Dunning, which tells the tale of when his father came home on a cold 1958 night and hurt his family, also hitting him in the leg with a hammer, leaving him with the nickname hop Toad Harry and a lit limb for the rest of his life. Al recruits Jake to go on an insane challenge, going into the past to save Harry's family. This adventure through the past leads men to many other tasks, each changing their present day. Al's last insane idea, the idea that would change the way they lived, was stopping the JFK assassination. Jake goes through ups and downs as he attempts to stop the assassination of JFK. Throughout the book, Jake's view on history as he knows it changes as he discovers different aspects and features of the past. Jake's character develops and changes as he ventures back in time to change the world's mistakes. Will Jake complete the mission? Read 112263 by Stephen King to find out.